Good morning, Florida Keys. Hey. Um, we are getting ready. You know you can't take a trip to the Keys without going to Key West. Have True. you heard of Key West? I have. I've been there twice. Okay. We're excited to spend I more know. time there, though. We are, because it's normally a cruise ship stop yeah. for us. You have like four hours or something in port. We got time. Uh, yeah, yeah, we got time today. So we're getting ready to make the drive. It's about an hour mm -hmm. over to Key West. Worth it. Yeah. So are you ready? Ready. Let's I'm roll. Ready. Jimmy Buffett is. I know. You look just like a margarita video. <laughs> anyway, let's go have fun. I know. We'll Bye. see y'all in Key West. Made it to Key West. Officially. We are walking down Caroline Street right now. Here comes a ding ding trolley. Um, <laughs> and we're gonna just do some wandering. We're gonna seek out some breakfast, first of all. <laughs> Look at all this cuteness. We are heading up here to Cuban Coffee Queen, because we're told it's a must. Cuban coffee gay. <laughs> this is strong. You uh, will definitely make it. Alright, cool. And we also got two Cuban bread with guava pressed. I don't know, that just sounded interesting. Is there cream cheese too? Yeah. Ah. Oh. It's very warm. <laughs> Ca -caw, ca -doodle -doo. Look now, you know I'm the king of totally accurate the Animal noises. Bird noises, especially. <sighs> anyway, we're having a little stroll now. Yeah. Uh, Key West does have, from what I understand, a nice little free bus loop. Whoa, look at them trees. I think it's called the loop, actually. Something like that. Yeah. But we're going to walk it out. Not that, we, out. not that we had much breakfast in us to walk out, but hey, that was That's delicious. That was a good hunk of bread. That was really good. It was. Anyway, <laughs> the stroll continues. Yeah. We're going down Margaret Street right now. Very scenic and treaty and pretty. You guys, wear your sunscreen. That's true. The sun is no joke. It's not. We went back to the car and reapplied and grabbed yeah. it. Well, gosh, they're very welcoming. I like the ice cream and the candy and, well, shoot, cats, dogs, small dragons. What the heck? I don't know. That's what I need to get me around Key West. What the heck? I don't even know how you use that. Well, I wouldn't, first of oh, all. Oh, your butt goes there. It's petals. I see it. Yeah, no. No, no. Those are really tiny people. We have reached Key West Cemetery. Ooh, very pretty. And, you know, there's lots of roosters in Key West. It's a Florida heritage site. Well, we're just going to take a sight of it from out here. Yeah, he's going to do some pictures over the bars. We'll just look at it through the bars. Yeah, see, you just do this. Nobody knows that you didn't go inside. Except for, of course, when you tell them. No, no, you're allowed to go in. We just have other objectives today as well. Lots of cool trees to look at. And lots of cool D's to look at. You have trees. There's trees on D. Y'all, we're on a nature tour of people's houses. <laughs> I've never seen them that bright, though. Hmm. Oh, key lime colored uh, lizard iguana. He's been eating key lime pie. Yeah. Do you have, yeah, as I say, do you have a sushi song? Mm, yummy. Oh. Tastes so good. Cool. I love sushi. That's all. <laughs> okay. That was good. Thanks. Welcome to Duval Street. Hey, Coke Train. We have found our next point of interest. It's time to play with some butterflies. Because I'm a beautiful butterfly. Got cute little photo ops. Oh, here's where they keep their D's. You are a beautiful <laughs> butterfly. Wow. There's your key lime pie butterfly. Another <laughs> Oh yeah. As a larva grows. Oh, don't let any friends out. Whoa, my gosh. Okay, well, you might find a friend. Yeah, especially if you blend in. You have to look like one of them. Perfect. It's 
It's a magical wonderland of nature. Oh my gosh. See, there's a food tray over here, which is probably why they're gathered right by the door. That makes sense. Yeah, this is a magical wonderland. Uh, well, it, 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 it grazed you. It's like bats. Yikes, this is awesome. Y'all are noisy. All right. I have like epic music going on. It's very calm and soothing and magical in here. Oh, you feel like a fairy? Yeah, like... You could grow wings like these butterflies. Y'all, there's some little nuggets in here. Look at y'all little birdie nuggets. Why am I making so much noise? Oh. I will follow the majestic D through the butterfly gardens. <laughs> it's so pretty. in the water. Ah, oh, the little one nugget got locked out from the rest of them. The other ones are in the pen. Big boy. Oh my goodness, beautiful. It looks soft. Don't touch it. No, I'm not gonna. And I've got all kinds of these little guides here so you can kind of know what birds you're looking at. to the end but we're gonna turn around and go back through because we want to see more butterflies we did find these beautiful pipes that blow <laughs> air out because it is very um humid in here oh, okay. yeah butterflies like pipes too <laughs> they've got some snacks for you in case you get hungry along the way mm, carrots okay. oh maybe Vlogging frog. <laughs> this could be me. Selfies on the toilet. Well, hmm. well, that was super awesome. Lots of nature. There's some more nature. Now we're walking back up Duval Street because we passed something earlier that I think we're gonna go check out. Key lime car. I found some lunch. No. Lunch time. Uh, You're like, bye. Bye. <laughs> Gosh, I was about to have you for lunch and you're telling people about it. <laughs> Come on now. Don't make me break out my 11 herbs and spices. Mmm, mm, you don't look as delicious. Come on, ride the train. 
right, it is time for a ride on the conch train. I have seen the conch train. It looks like a lot of fun. It's run by the folks at Old Town Trolley. We've done the trolley before, so we figured, you know what? Conch train today. It's about a 75 minute loop. It's a hop on hop off. The train has four stops, whereas the trolley has like, I don't know, 20. But I think we're gonna do a full loop to start off with just to see everything that we can see. Air conditioning. Yeah, kind of literal air is gonna be conditioning. You know, it's natural air conditioning. Welcome back to Duval Street. above that front doorway there, you'll see that Vatican seal, which is a high honor that can only be given by the Pope in Rome. Designates that as a minor basilica. This is only about six in Florida and 73 nationwide. Now back when the first customers stayed here, they thought eight to twelve dollars a night was outrageous to pay for a hotel room. Even though back then it included three meals. Well, I don't think you could get a room for anywhere close to that today in this beautiful hotel. That reef was a scene, the one to five wreck a week. And when a wreck would appear out on that reef, you could hear this call downtown on the waterfront. Now the first captain out on the scene was called the wreck master. He determined who did what. He was entitled to close to 60% of that salvage cargo. so many wooden structures still stand today. Now they were also fond of their woodworking ability and they called it gingerbread. We lined the rooftop with it. The first house that's what we would call arrowhead gingerbread. Mm. And the house right next door to it had gingerbread gingerbread. Very <laughs> possibly he was the town baker back in the day. He could go up there, have his morning coffee, look out over the reef, and if he spotted a wreck out there, he'd gather his crew together and they would head out and start salvage work. Well, it's said that he was a little on the unscrupulous side because he didn't get that wreck to shore call first. He just headed out there all on his own and started salvage. They brought us to the main depot and said we got about 10 minutes we can wander around in here, use restrooms, get drinks and all that sort of stuff. Oh man, they know we need the cold stuff. <whistles> Key lime pie soda. <laughs> Water cam. <laughs> Finally had someone who got it. Yeah, we are loaded back up. So it's cool they give you a little stop here at the main yeah. depot. I guess this is up by Front Street, just where most people get on the train. But yeah, he said, we'll be here for 10 minutes, use the restroom, get a drink, whatever, <laughs> hop back on. We're going to complete the tour loop. And then we're probably going to come back up to this Front Street area later on. So, yeah. And if you're wondering, um, masks are required. In case you're wondering why. You know, True. We have the plexiglass, but it's because they're part of the Department of Transportation. And even though I think Florida in general is kind of doing away with all of that, it's still required on you. So, something to know. True. Which is fine because it's really crushing. Yeah. How <laughs> many have called Duval Street? One of the longest streets in America, because it stretches from the Gulf of Mexico behind us all the way ahead of us. 
Did he land the Goshus? It is so only a little over a mile long. 14 blocks are home to well over 50 bars along this stretch. Well, this looks familiar. This is where we started our day. Right here by the Flagler stop. That's awesome. I want some more coffee. <laughs> Throw me a Cuban bread. open with crushed oyster shells, but there were picnic tables out there, and that's where your shrimpers would eat their meals, drink. I also learned some about Truman also. He loved to smoke cigars, drink scotch, and play poker with his secret service, but in a very ornate poker table, I would flip back over again, look like an ordinary dining room table. They told me the secret service got real good at flipping that table back over again after they heard Mrs. Truman was on her way back to the White House. So we reached the end of this tour, actually. I thought it was a continuous loop, but apparently it ends here at this main station. And if you want to continue, you have to switch trains. The other one's leaving in like two minutes. It's full. It looked pretty full. So but I think we're just... We're familiar with this area. That's true. We're up by the cruise terminal. Yeah. So we're going to wander around and see what we can see. Yeah, right here by the Shipwreck Museum. Back when we did the uh, Old Town Trolley when we were in on a cruise, this is where we boarded our trolley, I remember. Go to the aquarium. Get some conch fritters. Yep, there goes the other train. Well, let's explore some places that we have never had time to explore or taken time. You could ride the only escalator in Old Town? <laughs> yes! Funny. Oh my gosh, I see it. It's the escalator. World famous escalator. I love these cars. Oh yes, this is all done with paper. Hey, butterflies. Oh, look now. Yes, that's perfect. It's exactly what we need. We're riding the only escalator in Old Town just because we can. Guys, this is awesome. Can you believe we've never ridden this escalator before? Whoa. Oh, it's over. Some cute like artisan shops up here. Soap. All right, well then I guess um, you ride the escalator back down or you use the restrooms. Yeah. All right, escalator time. This was a fun adventure. <laughs> wow, air conditioning. Yeah, the air conditioning alone made this adventure worthwhile. There's boats everywhere. There's another location of Cuban Coffee Queen. Let's see if we continue out the back of this complex. Look at this water. Wow. I mean, we've seen this water before, but it's been a while. We can find it in it. Yeah, make the manatee noises. Maybe the manatees will show up. I always love that, watching that back. That's yeah. Back. Well, y'all, from here, we have come to one of the saddest places really in all of Key West. If we spin over here, is the cruise ship dock in Key West and there is no oh here comes a little boat That's our cruise ship. yay no here. there's no cruise ships here and actually we don't know if there will be any cruise ships oh. here for the foreseeable future so what with all the regulations and all that stuff 
anyway but yeah that's where we normally dock walk down that little pier and we're like yes key west but now, we're still here so. granted this vessel back there good gosh that could be a cruise ship that's a mega mega mega, mega yacht kind of people getting off. i know huh. anyway yeah i think as as of right now that's about the only size boat that you can take up in here yeah. look at all them seagulls and pelicans just like where's the cruise ships the water is gorgeous it is gallant lady all right well that's how we're uh, getting back to marathon we're just gonna hop on the gallant lady Sorry. yep these are all the same stores that we would haunt when we came off the ship i even remember yep key lime pie on a stick right there at the ice cream parlor man good times good times got the art gallery museum right over there here's some random artwork those folks are chilling we're having a stroll down Green Street. Ooh la la. Hey, they have a place called The Breakfast Club. The Breakfast Club 2. Oh, it hurts really good. Have you? Wow. Y'all, yeah. I'm getting more good flashbacks. Kermit's Key Lime Pie Shop. Mmm. There's the treasure trove right there. Chocolate dipped key lime pie on a stick. I'm in heaven. We have a Snacky heaven. We have procured two chocolate dipped key lime pie on a stick <laughs> and a couple of waters. Yeah. I need a snack. I didn't know they serve food here too. Yeah, we do. I do not want chicken noodles. <laughs> yeah, they got a little <laughs> cafe like you could grab lunch. Yeah. But yeah, this is the little cool. Well, we sat up in the koi pond area last time, but they got all this garden seating. Mm -hmm. What is the neatest way to bite this thing? I'm not quite sure. Let's go for the side angle. Mm. Refreshing and delicious. I know it's all over my face. It's fine. She's giving me hand signals like, clean your face, <laughs> fool. Mm. I seem to remember last time I was eating key lime pie on a stick. I believe there was also a chicken, if I'm not mistaken. It was not even this location. It was the one up by the cruise pier. Yo, <laughs> he's making like me hungry for lunch. I need some chicken fingers. Look at those little fingers. <laughs> Bye. Well, we were wandering back to the parking garage and came across Bo's fish wagon. All right, sounds good to me. shrimp plate with a salad. salad. <laughs> nice. I see you doing the healthy thing. Wow. Well, you know, I got grilled mahi with slaw. That is a big bowl of slaw. It is a lot of slaw. And we got, well, some Diet Pepsis, which we have already been tearing into. So, <laughs> yeah. We were just wandering along. I didn't know anything about this place, but the food is good. I looked it up on the Google. It's been here a long time, and even like Food Network folks have come here and talked about it. So we accidentally picked good. <laughs> and coming out the back door of the restaurant put us right over here by this building. We went right by on the uh, train with the Wyland mural. That's cool. I didn't realize the Sales to Rails Museum is included with your contour train ticket. That's cool. We're wandering back over now to Flagler Station. Hello, fine sir. Hello. Our afternoon activities have brought us over near the cruise ship pier to Opal Key Resort and Marina. Oh, I, I like marinas. I don't know, I feel like we're walking in circles. Yeah. Okay. 